2015 Sheriff's Community Crime Summit, would you please stand for the presentation of colors by the Orange County Sheriff's Office Honor Guard. Would you please remain standing for the singing of our national anthem by Amani J. Standifer from Wakaiva High School. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light What so proudly we held At the twilight's last gleaming Whose broad stripes and bright stars Through the perilous fire the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still Please remain standing for the invocation by Chaplain Gregory Clayton. Chaplain. Let us pray. Our Father, we come this morning, this gathering. As we come, we ask you to guide, lead, order our steps in your word this day. That once we have concluded this time together, there will be more unity, more togetherness, more understanding more of a working unit amongst law enforcement and citizens, God. And we pray today that you will be glorified in all that we do, and all that we do will bring edification to ourselves and others. We ask this in your name. Amen. Please be seated. Thank you very much, Chaplain Clayton, and especially Imani for that wonderful song. Let's give Imani another big round of applause for that song. She was just telling us a few moments ago about her single that's out. Is it going to be out soon? All right, fantastic. We love local artists. We love local people. Thank you for that song. At this time, it is my honor to introduce the Sheriff of Orange County and your host for today, Sheriff Jerry L. Demings. Sheriff Jerry L. Demings is a native of Orlando. He received his Bachelor of Science degree in Finance from Florida State University and his Master of Business Administration degree from Orlando College, which is now Everest University. He served as Orlando's first African-American police chief 
and the first African-American director of public safety for Orange County. In 2008, he was elected the first African-American sheriff and constitutional officer in the history of Orange County and was re-elected in 2012. Please help me welcome my boss, Sheriff Jerry L. Demings. Thank you, Jeff, for that wonderful introduction. I'm going to keep my comments short this morning, but I must also do some additional recognitions. Um, first off, I met Armani back in 2008 when I was out on the campaign trail. At that time, I believe Armani was about eight years old, and she was with her grandmother. And uh, I made a commitment to her. She, she sung right there on the streets of Orange County for me. And uh, I told her if I got elected at my uh, swearing in ceremony, we would have her come and sing the national anthem. And so Armani has grown up right before our eyes. She's now a junior at Wakaiva. And uh, her new single, High Again, is, is coming out. So we're going to see Armani in high places. But it's all about really elevating the youth in our community. I like to accentuate her because she represents the overwhelming majority of children in our community who are really doing exactly what they're supposed to be doing. They're not out getting involved in some of the bad things that you hear about in the news. So again, thank you, Imani, for being here and being the stellar young lady that you are. And thank you to her mother and her grandmother and uh, siblings for being here and supporting this initiative every year. She's in school, so I know that she is going to slip out here shortly. Also to uh, our chaplain, uh, the chaplain of the year uh, in the United States of America is recognized by the National Sheriff's Association. Uh, chaplain, thank you so much for that wonderful prayer, prayer this morning. Again, we are indeed one nation under God, the greatest nation in the world. And so it is uh, definitely an honor to be able to honor God as uh, we do in this country. Uh, of course, our Pope is here uh, in Washington, D.C. A lot is going on in America, and this is but one of many things going on today. I know many of you could have chosen to do other things, but for the seventh year in a row now, we have come out and done this particular crime summit. The goal is to ensure that we share with you uh, a crystal clear picture of what crime is in our community and what crime is not. You're going to hear from a number of speakers today. All of those issues that you are hearing talked about uh, in this nation as it relates to law enforcement, we're going to delve into those issues today. We're going to talk about uh, the state of heroin, the state of crime, homicide. We will talk about police community relations. And uh, we will also uplift you to be able to do the work that we all need to do to keep the keep this community as safe as it possibly can be. I will tell you that there are three things that must happen in any community if we are going to be successful in reducing crime. Number one, uh, your law enforcement agency must be engaged with the community. And so this is a community engagement opportunity for us. The number two thing that we must do in order to ensure that the community trusts us to do the right thing uh, when we are out policing is we must be transparent in what we do. And so this crime summit is all about being transparent uh, in our dealings at the Orange County Sheriff's Office. The third thing that we must do is hold ourselves accountable to the high standards uh, that the public expects from us when we deliver service in this community as professional law enforcement officers. Now, Jeff Williamson will uh, review many of our dignitaries who are here today, but um, collectively to all of our dignitaries who are here and sharing in this occasion, I thank you for being here. I would certainly be remiss if I did not recognize uh, Commissioner Siplin, Victoria Siplin is here. Commissioner, would you stand and be recognized? Uh, we must work uh, very closely with the Orange County Board of County Commissioners. Um, they are our partners. They are our principal funders uh, at the Orange County Sheriff's Office, and I appreciate the support. I am not certain if other commissioners are here, but if you are in the audience at this point, would you stand and be recognized? Okay. 
they may join us. If they join us at any time, we will certainly recognize them as well. Uh, Jeffrey has an entire list that he's going to go over. Uh, but again, enjoy today. This is going to be a tremendous opportunity for us to have dialogue together as we go forward. I hope you enjoy the lunch and the speakers to come. Thank you very much.